this could be exciting. Alrighty guys, so I haven't talked about it in a lot of videos, but I have basically been toying with the idea of getting another office area space but I didn't want to do something as big as what we had before and it needed to be close to me now that I have my baby it needed to be bigger than the space I was using at home and all this kind of stuff and I'm really excited because I think I just found the perfect place and I am so pumped about it you guys this could be exciting guys we are officially in the new office space so this is what it's looking like it's pretty much just a giant open room with really tall ceilings but i am obsessed this looks so good for what we're looking for I am super duper excited. We're not gonna actually get to move like anything into this office today at all because of all the orders that have been coming in. So we're gonna take care of all the orders this week and then we'll look about getting everything moved in this weekend for the office space. But I am so excited. Let me tell you guys a little bit about my ideas and then we gotta rock and roll home because Holly's got a doctor appointment. <laughs> so I'm thinking that over here on this wall is where I wanna put all of the transfer shelves. And then I think I wanna just put tabletops on top of them and potentially do like packing supplies and stuff over here on this shelf. This wall over here will probably be just tables or storage. And then again, we'll probably do more packing and tables along this long wall here. <laughs> Honestly, I have no idea. Maybe heat press like in this corner or something. I haven't fully decided, or maybe I'll do it in this corner. Got these just giant windows in here, which really gives some great natural lighting. So we love that. I'm very, very excited. Anyways, that is just a quick look at the office space today. We were gonna, like I said, we're gonna move everything in over the weekend. I'm so excited. I'm gonna make this a whole dedicated vlog. So I think those are all gonna go together. This is gonna be so fun. So I hope you guys are ready because it's gonna be so good. All right, guys, it is officially office move-in day. We are gonna get started with unloading or loading up the cars and getting as much stuff moved over today to the office space that we can. I'm so excited. Let's go. we are in the office space i went and grabbed a bunch of apparel boxes i literally have like 10 more <laughs> left from doing all the mystery sweatshirts that i still need to bring in here but i wanted to come back and get some more things undone and kind of set up so that i can get in here and work on monday let me show you guys what i'm thinking about for this space over here, I have this table with the printers on it. Ideally, I would like to get a taller shelf for those down the road, but for now, they'll be on this table. And then I think I'm going to put storage underneath here. I'm thinking maybe, maybe transfers down the road if I need that space, but I'm definitely gonna put some storage space under there to utilize that blank area. This standing table here, and this is where the heat press is gonna go. And then I can like lay shirts here as they're cooling before I peel off the transfers. I'm not sure if this shelf will stay here or not. We will see but it could potentially be a good choice or I don't know yet. Well, we're gonna see. Maybe eventually I'll move this down so these tables are closer and more connected. Then we have a sitting, well, whew, I'm out of breath, y'all. This table here is going to be a tall table as well. It's gonna be standing. I'm thinking maybe what I'll do is I might slide all this down and move this table along this back wall here and then maybe put the printers on this side in this little slot. That way these two tables can be tall together. They'll be standing height because I got some more risers for those. And then these two tables will be the ones where I mostly work on like apparel orders and things. So I can be standing when I'm pressing with the heat press. Then on the other side, I've got this table here. This is the one with the pink contact paper. And this is going to be where I pack orders. So this is gonna be like a place where I can have cute packaging videos and things like that. Then in the middle, right Right now I've got this table here. Um, this is like a tabletop from a different table and then I put transfer shelves underneath. These I'm getting risers for because this is almost standing height. It, it like could work if I needed it to, but I want it just a little bit higher so I'm not gonna be like bending my back over or anything like that. These are gonna be risen up and I could potentially fit a third 
transfer shelf in the middle of this if I wanted to make more room on this side. So on this side of the wall is where I'm going to be putting the transfers as they continue to grow and our stock and inventory starts to get bigger. So this little cube guy is gonna lay flat and then our transfer shelves will go sit on top of it so they're easily accessible. That way when I'm here, honestly, I probably need to turn these shelves around. I can be standing here and packing transfer orders and being able to grab, grab, pack, and then put it over here and they'll be good. So that's the goal with this little space. Corner on this side, um, there are really big windows here. This space is probably gonna be a bit more like personal space. So I'm gonna eventually put a chair, bring the mini fridge, all that kind of stuff. And then on this wall, I'm gonna be putting a bunch of little cube things that are gonna store extra blank apparel. And I might need to use some of this wall space for that as well. Um, and that'll cover up some of the windows too so that you know people don't see in as well because I don't know if you guys can tell by like looking through this office window through the other side, but you can kind of see into their office. So they have curtains and I got curtains for this window specifically because as you can see, people like park there and stuff. So I don't want them looking in. And like during the daytime, it's not that bad or anything, but like I definitely want to be able to shut the blinds at night. So I know over here on these two walls, I want to put my little pink pegboard so that I can pack and ship orders over here and it'll look really cute. So I think I'm going to do that, but I need to move this table out of the way for a minute so I can reach it. I want to be able to reach it when I'm like sitting down. I'm honestly just gonna eyeball this because I'm too lazy right now. This thing is pretty easy to install and it's from Amazon. I'll link it down below for you guys if you're interested. This looks so good. Okay, this is a smidge crooked, but we're all right. This thing got so messed up when we were transporting, so I've got to fix this for sure. <laughs> I don't want this here. So I know this looks a little funny on this setup here, but what I'm thinking is that I will eventually be getting more of these shelves as I go along or more of these. So if I put them down there, I can maybe fit two of these across here until we do more of those or something. And then I've got storage for things down here as well. Okay, update time. This is where I'm leaving it for today. Over here, I've got a bunch of apparel boxes. This is all going to have a storage unit and some inventory shelving. They're coming in tomorrow, so I'll set that up on Monday. This is inventory shelving. Currently, I only have a couple pieces on there because I haven't gotten around to folding things. Then over here, we have stuff for transfers and then storage. So on the top here, I've got transfer shelves. These are like keychain decals and things, um, envelopes, customs. And then down here is just a bunch of storage. So I've got packing supplies, cups, sublimation things, extra like thermal labels. This is a tumbler heat press that I haven't unboxed yet. A bunch of cords and another laptop stand. I don't know if I'm going to use that because I brought another one. It's over there. This is the little transfer packing station slash cutting station little island here. I'm not sure if I'm going to leave this cutter here if I want to do that. I think I do. And then ideally I would just like leave a shelf pulled out like this so that as I cut and then I place the transfers here and then I can pack all the orders later and then I want to use like the top ones to keep things like the thank you slips and stuff like that and like the clear baggies so then I can just pull them out and start packing orders here and then like drop them into a bucket on the end or something so I love that then we have the desk this is where I will pack orders and potentially do computer work so I really want to pack videos with kind of this little viewpoint right here. I think that will be really fun for social media content. Um, I need to find a lot more of my little storage things for these shelves, but I really like the poly mailers here and the tissue paper. And I've got plenty of space here that I can like put my laptop out of the way. This is random stuff I need to remember to do. This little bin is what I put a bunch of my orders in. And then over here, this is kind of just an extra table for 
putting t-shirts while they're being pressed, all that kind of stuff. This needs to be a little bit more reorganized as well. So I'll go do that in another video. And then over here, I've got heat press things. And this shelf right now just has sublimation paper, transfers for mystery sweatshirts that I'm working on, sublimation stuff, um, a little t-shirt folder and a cup holder. I've got heat press over here. Office chair won't stay there. And then yeah, the printer's on that side. So we are looking really good and I'm very excited about the progress and I cannot wait to show you guys the rest. As for now, I am literally like a hot sweaty mess and super tired. So I'm gonna go home. We're gonna hang out with the family and just chill for a little bit this afternoon. And tomorrow we're doing a whole Christmas day at home. So I'm super excited about that. Yeah, this has been super exciting. I'm very pumped to be in this office space. I'm obviously going to probably vlog a little bit more. I don't think I'm gonna end the one here. I think we're just gonna keep carrying on and I'll show you guys like the whole office progress, makeover, setup, all that good stuff. But for now, we're done for today. Good morning guys. So we are in the office this morning and the first thing on my list this morning was to set up some Wi-Fi. So I actually got this one on Amazon. It is called Solus and this is actually like a mobile Wi-Fi hotspot so you can take it places with you and it's no contract and then you can just choose what kind of plan you need for the month which is really helpful. So I got this and I just set it up and it's actually working. Yay! So this is what it looks like. It's like a little orange thing my bob i don't know um i'm charging it right now but i've got the wi-fi connected to pull out the rest of my to-do list to see what we need to do today so here is kind of my like rough draft of what i need to get done today it's gonna be a really busy day while my heat press is warming up i think i'm going to unbox a couple things over here that are to help with the office setup and kind of get the space looking a little better <laughs> making a wholesale order for some really cute cup coasters. So here are the three different ones I got. They got this little Christmas set and then they all come in a pack of two. So a little Valentine's Eve Western one and a little pink cheetah. Prepping some cheetah ones right here. And then I've got another set that's about to go on to the over here I still have um, probably about seven groups of large mystery shirt bundles I need to make and then I have two wholesale orders and a couple little one-off orders I'm almost done with this wholesale cup coaster order as you guys can see this is the last pattern and we have 15 sets of those so I finished all of the cup coaster order and now it's time to package them into their little baggies there's so many of them this is the last print, a little close up of the Western one, cheetah print, and then the Christmas one has two different patterns. They're a little more pinky on, or in real life rather than on camera. mystery sweatshirt orders done and I'm gonna go ahead and get some shipping labels on those and then after this I have about seven more 
that I really wanted to do today. And then I have a couple of TikTok shop orders that I would like to work on. And then also, um, we are being so productive. It's 1120 right now. I'm gonna crank these out and then I need to do transfer orders. That's what I need to do. wrapping up on packages for today or orders that are going out. This is the progress so far with the boxes. It's slowly coming together. Um, I had a little mishap, so I had to kind of like redo some pieces, but I'm thinking it's looking pretty good so far. I did not get a chance to put the apparel in it. I will work on that stuff tomorrow. All right, so I'm in the Lowe's and I am picking up some shelving because I decided to go with the shelves instead of the cube storage that you guys saw. I just think it's gonna be easier and I've had these in the past, so. I'm going for this really tall one. It's like over six feet tall and they have it in white, which is great. So I'm gonna go ahead and get two and then maybe get a black one as well. So I can have three. There's more way up there on top of the shelf, but I'm definitely not gonna bother anyone just to come and get one. Maybe I will, I don't know. Definitely not going to bother someone because it's all the way up there. So I'm not going to do that. But I did also get a duster and some Clorox wipes. So now we've got our cart packed. Let's go. All right, guys, I got one curtain put up. I had to pull on the ladder. I honestly didn't film myself because I was scared and I was really tall and high up. But I got it put up. I know it looks a little janky, but that's okay. Got the job done. <laughs> Everything else is a absolute disaster on this side of the office. Here is the shelf that I just got from Lowe's. I haven't unloaded the other two from the car. I'm going to do that in a minute. First, I'm going to do this one and move some of this stuff over and get some items actually put on it so I can clear out the space on the floor and get some of these boxes out of the way so that we can make some room. but these are mostly just for the mystery sweatshirts that are going on right now. So as you can see, this is like smalls, mediums, larges. Then this will be extra larges, 2XL and the 3XL on the bottom. And I've got a bunch more still at home. So I've got to bring a lot of that inventory over and that's definitely gonna change some things. I can't decide if I wanna keep the cube shelves or not, but I think I'm gonna use this just for t-shirts because I don't keep t-shirts in stock that much and mostly I just have a bunch of sweatshirts right now.
Okay, so this is what the other side is looking like right now. And I'm not sure what I'm gonna put on the black shelves just yet or if I wanna keep the t-shirts in this shelf thing. Let me, tell me what you guys think down below. <laughs> I think for now what I'm gonna do is put the other boxes of stuff on here. And those are typically like other colored sweatshirts or ones that I know already need to go to an order. some orders look how cute those are and i did these really fun little cup coasters these are a new item in the shop look how fun those are they went with this really cute little howdy sweatshirt and then i've got some tiktok shop orders over here and i'm gonna pack up some orders all right guys so i think i'm going to end off the vlog here i really hope you guys enjoyed watching kind of this whole little move-in process of our office i'm so excited to be in this space and continue kind of growing our business from here i literally i'm so happy you guys will see so many more vlogs coming um and i can't wait to bring those to you guys because they're gonna be so fun in here but i think i'm gonna close this one here because honestly the rest of the stuff is just gonna be like actual work things and less like about the actual office space so i will pick up for the next vlog as always you guys can find another video here as well as the entire playlist full of the vlogs down here you'll find our subscribe button and then lastly over here you'll find the link to our website where you will find everything that we talk about on a daily basis and what we do um, and if you're interested in any of the items that we sell, we'll have that all linked down below. Anything else that I can think of, I will also try and link for you guys in the description, like my pink pegboards, these shelves back here, stuff like that. Cause I know you guys will ask lots of questions about those. So yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I will see you all in the next one. Bye guys.